Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to us at Screen Revelations. Last time, we bought Jelana Tower and explored it. This time, we're back inside the hideout to see what we can do. So we have another Altier mission. So let's start the Altier mission for key number two. Do we know how Altier even died? You held fire in your hand, old man. It should have been destroyed. Destroy the only thing capable of ending the Crusades and creating true peace? Never. Forgive me for this, Mentor. But the apple corrupted you, and through you it would have corrupted us. For us to live, you had to die. Yep, that's good one ending. Is it truly over? Is that sorcerer dead? He was no sorcerer. Just an ordinary man in command of illusions. Have you prepared the pyre? I have, but... Altair, some of the men will not stand for such a thing. Let me handle it. Do not lose more than three synchronization points. So don't lose three hit points? Is that what I'm understanding? <gasps> Are you fit to travel? Well enough. Yes. I asked Malik to ride to Jerusalem with news of Al-Mulim's death. So much Would you ride to Akre and do the same? Of course. This is literally direct what happened after Assassin's Creed. Okay. My mind was clear, but my body, it would not move. Was our mentor the cause of this confusion? I do not believe this. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. I have a lot of health. What has happened here? Our mentor deceived us all. The Templars corrupted him. Where is your proof? Walk with me, Abbas, and I will explain. And if I find your answers wanting, I will talk until you are satisfied. Do you remember the artifact we recovered from Robert the Sao in Solomon's temple? The artifact you were sent to retrieve, but others delivered? Yes. It is a Templar tool. The Apple of Eden. It can conjure illusions and control men's minds. A deadly weapon. And you believe al Mualim fell under its spell? I do. Today he used the Apple to enslave Masyaf. You saw that for yourself. I do not know what I saw. Listen, Abbas. The apple is safe in Al Mulin's study. When I'm finished here, I. Oh, never mind. <laughs> hmm. Altair! No! I must know that he cannot return. But this is not our way. To burn a man's body is forbidden. Defiler! Hear me out. This body could be another one of Al Mulim's phantoms. I must be certain. Lies! All your life, you have made a mockery of our creed. You bend the rules to suit your whims, while belittling and humiliating those around you. Restrain him! Did you not hear him? Al Mualim is bewitched. Ah! Wow. <clears throat> Well, if you're gonna keep the body off, take care of the body. You can't just do whatever you please, you That's not good. That's definitely not good. Shit! Alright! You win! I can take care of you. I will do anything. Just let me go. Yeah! 
Over. Are you fit to travel? Well announced. Yes. I asked Malik to ride to Jerusalem with news of Al Mu. Alright, let's try this again. Who would have thought climbing would be the problem I would have? Alright. Apple bead in which we did first see. Well, we have we've seen it back. He's definitely dead.
That was it? Okay. I'm kind of disappointed. As per usual. Altair. Barely 26, and already a Grandmaster in command of a divided order. How does one cope with such responsibility? And unlimited power? I need to repair my armor. Uh-oh! Looks like we're done with Sequence 4, though. Yep. Goodbye. I have made the acquaintance of an Ottoman prince named Suleiman. He's a clever young man, with a fortitude uncommon for his age. On his suggestion, I will be investigating some wayward Janissaries, who may be in league with the Templars. With luck, they will lead me straight to the core of the Templars' leadership. Meanwhile, the Venetian Sophia Sartor continues to help me find the hidden Maziav keys. She is a diligent woman, full of passion and vigor, and I enjoy her company immensely. But I dare not tell her the purpose of my stay here, nor of my true vocation. Those who do not volunteer in our struggle should not be forced to fight it. I'm pretty sure Solomon is all the magnificent, the most famous on the floor ever. So it'd make a lot of sense. His name matches up. You see this one? Incredible quality. Your feet will love you more than your wife does. I am not married. Ah, you are better off. Come, Philip. You have sold well today. I have not sold a thing. The Janissaries confiscated most of my rods just because they were imported. Do you know Tariq Barletti, their captain? Uh, he's around here somewhere. An arrogant man, but... Uh, you insult me, sir! I cannot take less than 200 lakhs for this! My final offer! When I find him, I will ask about the rugs. You drive a hard bargain, Yabanche! Shall we compromise at 180? 180 lakhs! And we part as friends! Hmm. Is that two guards? Oh, that's Actually, can I, is there any new armor? There is, ma'am? Luke armor, which I don't know if ma'am looks dead at this point or not.
mean, this sounds easy enough. Excellency, I will gladly come by tomorrow and bring many examples of my work, of course. I have been after his association's business for years and will much appreciate any introductions you can provide. Yes, actually, I'm quite happy with how it turned My sister. Of all Mehmet's accomplishments, I'm beginning to think this bazaar was the finest. You have no business here, you do not belong! Lead the way! The captain's not a happy man. He's in here to pass the way. He also wants to retire soon, so I made the... No loitering! <laughs> Sell he must. God strength! It is nice to see there. life returning to normal. If you have no business here, you do not belong! Discovering the vibrant glory of the old days. I hope it will endure. I noticed the pillar. $23 if it hurts anybody's feelings. This is an important meeting. Make sure I am not being followed. Gypsies are doing their job. Don't mind me, I'm just a gypsy. Oh, 
like when things go right. It doesn't happen often, but when it does. Do Gypsy things, yeah. Good job, Gypsy. You there. I will be back tomorrow. And if you have not disposed of all this foreign made garbage, I will confiscate it myself and throw it into the Bosphorus. Lead the way! Thank you, Reign of Assassin. I mean, you made my life a whole lot easier. news. Manuel has agreed to meet you, Tarek. He's waiting by the arsenal gate. <laughs> An eager old weasel, isn't he? Come. Janice Harris, are you ready to die? I have two missions to choose from. What are my options here? I need to find a viewpoint here, too. We have that memory. There's another one, right? No, there is two. Guys, next time on Assassin's Creed Revelations. I'm figuring out what that meeting's about. 